And today we're back with another tips and tricks video, but this time we're playing Warzone, so I'm super excited about that. And we hit five likes, so time to leak my M4A1. All right. So I have the um, FSS 11.5 inch Commando as my barrel. I have no laser, no muzzle, and no optic stock. I have no stock. And I use a 60 round mag because that's insane. And I use some strip tape because, well, um, it, it makes it super fast. Like when I aim, it's like almost instant. And FMJ because it does more damage, obviously. And yeah, and I use a no stock because, um, it, once again, it makes my aiming speed super duper fast and my movement speed super fast. So I'm like super like speedy. And the commando because a uh, aiming speed and movement speed, so that's really good. Just a disclosure, guys, I haven't played Warzone in so long. Like, I played it like, when like um, Modern Warfare came out, but other than that, I haven't played in so long. So I'm probably gonna be garbage. So, <laughs> but yeah, guys, if we get like um, 10 likes next video, then. Uh, I'll show you some some you guys can tell me in the comment section what type of games you want to see more advice on I could have play a bit first obviously but then I I'm sure that I will give you some good advice so what's kind of cool about warzone is that this is time to practice so we can like just um, eliminate enemies oh just shot me at the sky what the Okay, that like, never happens. Uh, must have a really good gaming chair or aimbot. <laughs> and by the way, you guys, um, you do die if you do not put your parachute on. Another thing that took me a while to figure out was that you can jump off buildings and if you can like so you're gonna die if you don't deploy your parachute. So as long as you deploy a parachute, you are not going to die. I think this time I'm gonna go uh I don't know. A boneyard. You guys should always land like by a vehicle. Or like a shop. And so you always want to land there because then if like someone's fighting you or like, you can just get away easily if someone's fighting you or not so that's really useful <laughs> and you always uh so this thing called the gulag if you never played before this thing called the gulag and basically so like once you die you get to respawn which is super duper cool um and yeah And keep in mind, guys, you do not start out with any uh, grenades. So basically, what you want to do every time you load in a match. So you're gonna see. Um, uh, how can I? Okay, right here, where it says my name. This is like blue. That's your shield. You press four. So uh, you press four. That's gonna apply shield on you. It's gonna like Fortnite, like when you're like a hundred, a hundred. It's like when you have a hundred shield. And 100 health. And so you just get extra protection, and that's really good, obviously. And so this game is pretty much kind of like it's just pretty much like PUBG, except uh, in my opinion, it's 10 times and better. And yeah, these. So if you have enough money, you can buy an armor plate bundle. That's one of the best. Like gas mask, cluster like UAV. You know, what, uh, if you know what a UA UAV is, basically, so uh, you can't see the enemies like on the mini map unless they shoot, right? With the UAV, 
you can see them regardless. That's kind of cool. And a lot of people camp in buildings. <laughs> so everyone camps. There's really, nothing you can really do about it other than, you know, like I said before, sliding. You know what I'm saying? So these are contracts, so basically, as long as I just kill this one person, um, or, or like secure some places, then you will um, get a lot of money. And with money, you can buy shields and a bunch of like, uh, kill streaks and all that. Score streaks, I mean, all that good stuff. And this really cool thing that uh, is called the loadout drop. So what I do sometimes, uh, I make my own like custom loadouts. They're really good for multiplayer, and another one that's really good for Warzone. So I'm still trying to figure it out. I'm still testing a bunch of stuff out. It's not that hard to um, do the thing. Um, uh, uh, find loadout drops. They're pretty common. I'm not gonna lie, but yeah. I, I, uh, leave in, in the comments if you want to see some more. Uh, if you want to see me. Um, cover some really good uh, if you want to see me cover some really good warzone loadouts I already showed you my multiplayer loadout that one's OP so sometimes you guys gotta memorize a bunch of the guns cause um, and like uh, how good they are how like if they laser or not because though well, obviously that's really good so you can tell like you can take a Odin oh okay heavy as heart rifle <laughs> you can see like because the M4 A1 shoots like super fast, it's like a laser, right? But the uh, the Odin does not shoot very fast, not shoot very fast at all. So you want to take notice of that, so you can really, so you can always miss, know like, okay, Odin, I do not want that. If it's, if you have the M4 A1. This game is also very scary. Um, sometimes the enemy can shoot you from a place you never thought people could reach. <laughs> and it's really weird. Always want to shield up. Because you're going to die super easily. And you got to go to the gulag. And once you respawn, you only have a pistol. That <laughs> really sucks. Another mission in the top left corner it says recon secure the intel and it has three minutes and 46 seconds so and for the money amount of money you get if you secure the objective mm -hmm. so once, uh, when the enemy team is tracking you so basically they're, well, they're, being, they're tracking you and once they, if they kill you and they get a lot of money from so when you're being tracked to look out and see how this stuff all right so as you see uh, on the top right my mini map so you see like there's cars yeah some other cars and um, and with that, I mean, it's in the cars. They're pretty noisy. And cool with. So every time like someone's near you, it automatically shows that your car is like red. That means the enemy. So people always know, and you can honk. I don't know why you would though. And you can run over people. It does a lot of damage also. But yeah. So this is the gulag. So this is where it's like a prison kind of. If you play gunfight, uh, it's still got taken out. This is one of the maps. Just to get so one v one, and you get like some type of gun. So you, uh, and when it's overtime, you can like cap these flags. And yeah. So that guy won. Now it's gonna be my time. I only get so once I if I win the uh, um gulag, I only get one chance. So I can't go here again. <laughs> And once again, guys, I just wanted to know if you get 10 likes this video, I will be showing you guys some really good Warzone 
um, uh, Warzone loadouts. And next video, I know what I'm doing already. I'm gonna be showing you guys uh, how good this gun actually is. This is a multiplayer M4A1. This gun is insane. And I'm just gonna show you guys if it's your type of gun, and if it's not, then it's not. And that's too bad. You can look at a bunch of other YouTubers. Um, show me the good type of um, loadouts. I don't know, it's Nick. He did really good loadout videos. Alright guys, so that's gonna be it for today's video. I hope you had a dope time. If you did, please drop a comment saying you had a good time. And drop some goals you have in life. If you're starting a YouTube channel or not. If you're starting a YouTube channel, drop some goals. How many subscribers do you want? I, I will subscribe to you. And uh, drop a like. Uh, really help me out. And comment what game I should do some tricks on next. Thank you. Thank you.